Hi guys, welcome to my video tutorial in mathematics. Um, today, I'm gonna teach you how to graph linear equations in two variables. Again, uh, our lesson today is graphing linear equations in two variables. So, the graph of a linear equation in two variables is a straight line. And this will be drawn in our Cartesian plane. Okay? So, and you need materials. Kailangan nyo ng mga materials like uh, graphing paper at saka ruler. But if you don't have a ruler, you can use uh, even a straight edge. Okay? Now, let's take the first example. Our first example is... Graph 2x plus y equals 4. Again, graph 2x plus y equals 4. So, in graphing this, uh, the first step that you're going to do is you are going to determine at least three ordered pairs that will satisfy the equation. So, kailangan mo munang magkaroon ng at least three ordered pairs. How? Okay, by assigning x or y. Pwede kang mag-assign ng value ng x or value ng y pansamantala. Okay, let's take the first one. If x is equal to 0, what is the value of y? Okay, so isolve mo yung given equation. 2x plus y equals 4. Then 2 times 0, the value of x plus y equals 4. So, if you multiply this, it will be 0. Okay, pwede na natin i-cancel yan. y is equal to 4. So, our y is 4. Remember, if x is equal to 0, in this equation, the value of y is 4. How about kung yung y naman yung papalitan ko ng 0? Okay, so what happened to 2x plus y equals 4? It will be 2x plus 0 replacing y equals 4. Then 2x is equal to 4. To find x, we will divide 4 by 2. So the value of x is positive 2. Again, if y is 0, then the value of x in this equation is 2. Halimbawa naman, um, balik ako kay x negative 2. So, what happened to 2x plus y equals 4? It will be 2 times negative 2 plus y equals 4. This is negative 4 multiplying positive 2 and negative 2. Then, plus y equals 4. Bring down y equals 4 Transposing negative 4 to the other side, that will be positive 4. So, therefore, the value of y is positive 8. Okay. So, these are the ordered pairs. Nakabuo tayo ng tatlong ordered pairs. We have 0, 4, 2, 0, negative 2, 8. Okay. Then, let's proceed to step 2. In step 2, you need to draw Cartesian plane and then plot the ordered pairs. So, ito na yung ating Cartesian plane. Sana marunong kayo. Kaya nga, I will advise you to use your graphing paper in order for you to uh, maintain the distances. No, Kailangan equal yung distances. So, this is our y-axis, x-axis. Now, let's plot the first ordered pair. We have 0, 4. It should be in our y-axis. Dito yan siya. 0, 4. Then, uh, 2, 0 is here. Ayan. Then, negative 2, 8. It is here. After plotting the three ordered pairs, gagamit kayo ng uh, straight edge or ruler. Okay? So, you connect the three points. So, ito yung nabuo natin. So, this line is the graph of 2x plus y equals 4. Tandaan natin, lahat ng mga ordered pairs na matatagpuan dito sa mga uh, intersection point, yan, 
they belong to our solution set. Okay, let's take the another example. Okay, graph y equals x plus 4. Again, graph y equals x plus 4. So, as usual, bago tayo makakapag-graph, kailangan muna natin na maka-determine at least 3 ordered pairs. Kailangan natin magkaroon ng tatlong ordered pairs. How? So, we will assign, okay? Gagamit tayo ng table, ayan, for the value of x and for the value of y, okay? So, if x is equal to, remember ha, our equation is y equals uh, x plus 4. Ayan, graph, y equals x plus 4. So, if x is equal to 1, what is the value of y? The answer is 5. Because 1 plus 4 equals 5. How about if y naman yung palitan natin? Okay? How about if y is equal to 2? So let's solve. y equals x plus 4 will become 2 is equal to x plus 4. Then reverse tayo. x plus 4 equals 2. Bring down x equals 2 minus 4. So the value of x is negative 2. Negative 2. Okay? Next. How about if balik tayo kay uh, x. How about if x is equal to 0? So, what happened to y? The answer is 4. Diba? Because uh, y is equal to x plus 4. When you substitute x into 0, the value of y will be 4. Ayan. Okay? And then after that, we're going to plot the ordered pairs. Ano-ano yung mga ordered pairs na nabuo natin? So, we have here, 1, 5. Ito naman, negative 2, 2. Then, 0, 4. Okay? So, this is in quadrant 1 kasi pareho silang positive. So, 1, 5 is here. Yan yung 1, 5. Then, how about negative 2, 2? It is in quadrant 2. Okay, negative 2 comma 2 is found here. And mas maganda sana kung graphing board o kaya graphing paper. And then the last one is 0 comma 4. 0 comma 4. Ito. Okay, so ito yung mga tatlo na nabuo natin from this ordered pair. After plotting these points, we are now ready to connect. Okay, so using your ruler or straight edge, we will connect them. Okay, so this line, yung nakikita nyong line, uh, that's the graph of y equals x plus 4. So, ayan, no? It is a straight line. Again, uh, lahat ng mga makikita nating uh, points na madadaanan ng line na to, lahat ng madadaanan niyang points, they belong to ordered pairs. Okay, so again, uh, review tayo how to graph linear equations into variables. First, kailangan meron kayong materials. You have the graphing paper, you have your straight edge or ruler. Then, uh, in graphing it, first you need to uh, determine at least three ordered pairs. 
by assigning, no? Gamit kayo ng table, kagaya nito. Then, after that, after obtaining three ordered pairs, you draw Cartesian plane, okay? Using your uh, graphing paper. After that, you plot the points. After plotting the points, you connect them. Okay, so thank you for watching. Uh, hanggang sa muli po, salamat.